There are some people in the entertainment industry who leave a lasting impression on the industry. John Schneider, a skilled actor, musician, and director, is one such personality. Schneider has earned a sizable fortune through his different activities over the course of his career. We see net worth will look at John Schneider net worth and salary in 2023 in this article. What is John Schneider's net worth and salary 2023? John Schneider is an American actor and country singer who has a net worth of $200,000. Schneider gained widespread recognition for his role as Bo Duke in the hit television series The Dukes of Hazard. In addition to his acting career, he has released nine studio albums and several chart-topping country singles. John Schneider Overview Early Life On April 8, 1960, John Richard Schneider was born in Mount Kisco, New York. He is the youngest of Shirley Conklin and John Jack Schneider II's three kids. However, he only had one sibling, older brother Robert, because his other brother died before Schneider was born. A natural entertainer, Schneider began performing when he was eight years old, appearing in a magic show for friends and family. He left school a year early to pursue his acting career. Career John Schneider is an American actor and country singer. He began his acting career at eight, appearing in several productions in New York City. He went to Atlanta, Georgia, with his mother when he was 14, where he continued to perfect his craft in local theatrical performances. Schneider's big break came when he was cast as Beauregard Bo Duke in the classic television series The Dukes of Hazard. This role catapulted him to fame and opened doors for other notable roles such as Jonathan Kent in the popular TV series Smallville and James Jim Cryer in The Haves and The Have-Nots. In addition to his successful acting career, Schneider has made a name for himself in the music industry. Since the early 1980s, he has released nine studio albums, a greatest hits package, and 18 singles, including chart-topping hits like I've Been Around Enough to Know, Country Girls, What's a Memory Like You, and You're the Last Thing I Needed Tonight. His passion for music led to his induction into the Louisiana Music Hall of Fame in 2019. Schneider's passion for storytelling and acting led him to write, direct, and produce indie films. He owns and operates John Schneider Studios, JSS, in Holden, Louisiana, providing a one-stop shop for independent filmmakers to create their stories and films. Throughout his career, Schneider has made guest appearances on various TV shows, such as Hee Haw, Dr. Quinn, Medicine Woman, Diagnosis, Murder, Touched by an Angel, Jag, Walker, Texas Ranger, CSI, The Secret Life of the American Teenager, Leverage, Desperate Housewives. John Schneider's varied and successful career in the entertainment industry demonstrates his commitment, enthusiasm, and talent. From acting in iconic television series to producing chart-topping music and supporting independent filmmakers, Schneider has left an indelible mark on the world of entertainment. Personal life. Schneider married his first wife, former Miss America Tani Elaine Godin, in 1983. In 1986, they divorced. In 1993, he married his second wife, Ellie Castle. Castle's two children from her former marriage are among their three children. In 2014, Castle filed for divorce. Schneider began dating Alicia Elaine in April 2015. Elaine is not only the owner of Maven Entertainment, but also his producing partner and personal and professional manager. Schneider and Elaine tied the knot in September 2019. But in 2023, she died. Why is John Schneider famous? John Schneider's celebrity can be linked to his exceptional talent and the influence he has had on popular culture. His performance as Bo Duke in The Dukes of Hazard established him as a cultural icon, and his subsequent roles demonstrated his flexibility as an actor. Schneider's contributions to the entertainment industry go beyond acting. He has also demonstrated musical talent and dabbled in filmmaking. FAQs about John Schneider. What happened to John Schneider's wife? John Schneider paid tribute to his wife, Alicia Elaine, on Wednesday, who died on Tuesday following a fight with breast cancer. She was 53 years old. The actor and country musician shared a photo of his late girlfriend, whom he referred to as my smile, smiling and giving a thumbs up on Instagram. Why did John Schneider leave? Schneider and co-star Tom Wopat left the show for much of a season in 1982 due to a tangle of legal disputes with the producers over the division of merchandising earnings. Luke Duke's net worth is unknown. What is the net worth of Luke Duke? 
Tom Wopat, Luke Duke, is worth an estimated $2 million. Denver Pyle, Uncle Jesse, was reported to be worth $5 million prior to his death. What is Selena Gomez's net worth? Selena Gomez has a net worth of $95 million due to her work as an actor, singer, producer, composer, and brand endorsements. What is the net worth of Duke Northumberland? He is the beneficial owner of Northumberland Estates and the titular owner of Annick Castle, and his net worth is estimated to be £315 million. John Schneider is a well-known person in the entertainment world. His career took off when he played Bo Duke in the TV show The Dukes of Hazard, and he continued to succeed in TV, movies, and music. Finally, thank you for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe us to learn more interesting information about celebrities.